Hello, people out there. It's music time, man. What time do you think it is? It's music time. 10, paint me naked. I think, maybe I should move this mic. Oh, I shouldn't, I shouldn't mess with it. I shouldn't mess with it, but I'm gonna, over there, maybe, over here. We'll find out. Anyways, 10, paint me naked. Ten. I would pronounce the Korean tain. Wouldn't you use the straight line for the... No, that'd be teen. Ten. Ah, whatever. Let's go. That's... That's a very cool guitar line. Whoa, I have already loved this. Let me write down to edit this. I want to figure that guitar line out right now. Where is my pick? right ah, it's all E major that was uh, let's go goes up to A. Oh, and it goes back to E. Ah, it's the same, it's the same, it's the, it's the same melody. Something like Nope It's kind of like that I think that's pretty close Oh. Oh, 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 
can I play it? Come on, vodka, don't let me down. Nope. <laughs> so close. Something like that. E to A. E major to A. Come back. fuck with cheetah print or whatever it is yellow with black spots always and forever oh, there's is that lion no it's not lions don't look that way lions don't have spots oh Oh, it's longer. The break was extended. The rhythm in the beginning was also off kilter. And then the drop, when they cut the music out, it didn't come where you thought it would be. What? No. Oh, never mind. If you were counting, it came in on, on time. I wasn't counting. I was feeling. This is fucking straight. This is fucking amazing. It's like perfect. It's ah oh, every like I oftentimes I hear like the guitar shit in pop music and in K-pop and it's like cheesy but this is interestingly done <laughs> Holy shit, I can't say it enough. This song is fucking awesome. It's just different and great. It's got all the things that you would expect. The choreo, the visuals. But it's like just different enough. Man, like I tell my, my peoples. When they're trying to like reach an audience. People want what they already know. They just want what they know to be a little bit better. And this is exactly what we know, but it's a little bit better. It's like, it's like, actually, it's a, it's a lot of bit better, but it's not, it's not radical. Uh, who was rocking that look before? Dude, it's gotta be it's gotta be one of them either Crush or Zico. Gotta be. Oh, 
Oh, I love that belly line. I don't know. I can't sing it, man. But it's like the cool little half step back up. Three chromatic tones that go up. It's like a, a pleasant little tone, and then it's a dominant tone, and then it resolves. That's savage. Also, that chord progression that just happened was this descending. So we had this ascending chromaticism in the vocal line, and then we had descending chromaticism in the uh, in the guitar line. Chromaticism is it's just a fancy word that just means shit in a row, in a row. So if like A A sharp B chromatics, A A flat G chromatics. I want to hear it one more time. I'm gonna, dude, that shit is awesome. I'm also gonna guess that that would be. That's either gotta be heading to the five or the one. What else would it be going to? It could start, okay. It's either five going down, four going down, or, or the root going down. on the D. That sounds like this is the root. That's gotta be it. Gotta be. Chromatics. That song is killer. Wow, that song is wow. Wow, that song is dude, that song is so good. See, goals go to shit. I was like, let's sit down and let's at least do two or three videos before taking a break. This song is so good. I'm gonna go listen to it right now again. Oh, wow, wow. Sorry, there's this guy I listen to, um, Jim Rohn, and he'll say things like that. It's like from 1992. I didn't watch it in 92, but it's from 1992. And he'll say things like, wow. He'll say some couple statements and he'll say, wow. It's like now I found myself doing that and it's probably dumb. But wow. This song's fucking great. <laughs>